hello, 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 everything Pisces. Welcome, 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 babies, if you're new here. Welcome back if you are returning. Come on in, like, subscribe, comment, share. Thank you guys in advance. Personals are open, tips, donations, links to the other YouTube channels are all down below in the description box. Zodiac signs are also always found in the description box as well for the reads. So my babies, you already know what it is. Kick your feet up. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit. And get comfortable. Because we about to make it do what it do. Okay, love. So we're going to jump into this read. Pisces. Haven't used this deck in a while. So let's see. It still looks brand new. And I've had this deck for years. <laughs> Uh, at least three, y'all. <laughs> I don't know. It was on the other shelf, so I didn't pull them out. Since I moved, I put out a lot of decks because I changed where I was keeping them. So a lot of decks that I hadn't been using, y'all may start seeing more of as well, guys. Pisces. Okay, so somebody either has the Midas touch right now or someone is a miser. It came out upright, so this is the light attributes. It says entrepreneur or creative ability to turn anything to gold. Delight in sharing life's riches. So right now, guys, if you are an entrepreneur, thinking about being an entrepreneur, it's been on your heart to start your own shit, this is confirmation. We're finna, about, finna talk about somebody who's an entrepreneur, Pisces, so, or been thinking about being an entrepreneur. If you are not an entrepreneur, this this read probably won't be for you. Or if you haven't been thinking about doing it. Um, because it came straight out the back. We're going to be talking about some type of entrepreneur here. That has the Midas touch. Whatever you touch turns to gold here, Pisces. And there's somebody out here that was trying to destroy this. It came out upright as well, but it says releasing what is potentially destructive, pre preparing for a new life. So this could be you too, Pisces. You could be releasing what no longer serves you. Okay? Things that could have been destructive to you, caused destruction on your path, because you wanted a new life. And you could have set out on the entrepreneurial path, created something here that is turning to gold, or that will turn to gold. Tell me one for my Pisces. Okay, they both came out upright as well. We have Delatante. De Did I pronounce that wrong? I don't know if I pronounced that right, y'all. Delatante. If anybody else, I mean, you can't tell me in the comment section, but that's the word. D-I-L-E-T-T-A-N-T-E. -E. It came out upright. We're going to read the definition. It says, delights in the arts without having to be a professional. It says, alerts you to the danger of becoming superficial in your pursuits. So this is someone here who um, may be doing something creative. They could be taking this creative ability and turn it into some type of entrepreneurial um, business here. I also feel like this could be your intuition because it alerts you to the dangers of becoming superficial. So I feel like you you release the things that possibly would have made you become superficial if this business took off or when this business takes off here for you. I feel like you're very humble. And right as I said that, y'all, the next card says humility. I can't make it up. It says student. Humility and devotion to knowledge. Openness to lifelong learning. So I feel like you set out on some type of creative path here. You turned this creative path, this creative endeavor, whatever it may be, into some type of entrepreneurial endeavor. That is turning into gold or that is going to turn into gold. It's blowing up for you. But you healed, you released anything that was negative so that you could have this new life here. And because you released the negativity, you remain humble here. You're constantly learning, moving forward, understanding 
understanding yourself and the path that you're on here, Pisces. Yeah, see, I knew it. There is somebody out here that wanted what you had. I told you there was a destroyer here. There was somebody who did not want you to have this gold. They did not want you to have this success. And I feel like they tried to block you. There was a thief here. Can I find this miser? Midas. You see, you're a divine child. Your innocent, pure redemption suggests a special connection with the divine. You have a special connection with the divine here, Pisces. And this connection is what's leading you to this gold. This is what's allowing you to have the ability to whatever you touch to manifest into something good and great into your life. And somebody wanted to destroy that because you released your negative energy. You healed. You prepared for the new life. This life of riches here. And somebody wanted to stop you. Can I find this destroyer? Yeah, somebody been watching. This detective. They're they're observing your your um great powers, your intuition. So here, Pisces, you have some type of great power of observation and intuition. You have the desire to seek out the truth, right? And somebody tried to knock your gifts. You healed. You used your intuition here to move forward to prepare for this new light. Clarify Delante. Huh. Could be somebody you were in a love connection with. With this lover. That has been watching you and wanting to destroy you. They're watching you shine. They're watching you become this mighty. They're watching you have this divine connection. They're watching God bless you here. And they see you being humble. You may post. Some type, you may paint or do some type of artwork. You may be into um, gardening or flowers here. You may post this up. You may write. But it says great passion and devotion. Unbridled appreciation of someone or something. Yeah, there is someone here who has this appreciation for you. Or wants to be with you. But I don't feel like you are giving to them. This may be someone... That you removed when you were releasing things that were potentially destructive. And whoever this lover was that you removed from your circle. It could be a family, a friend, an ex. Because you removed them, they've been watching you trying to figure out how to destroy you. And you're still out here remaining humble, learning, moving forward. Um, staying connected to your connection with the divine here. Clarify student for Pisces. What is this? Uh, it says child orphan. It says independence based on learning to go it alone. Conquering fear of surviving. Yeah, see, you learned how to be independent. Whoever this lover was, I feel like they were codependent upon you. Friend, family, ex, whoever this is. You release these people. It could be more than one person. People that you had love for. Does not have to be a sexual connection. But you knew they were destructive for you. Or it would cause some type of potential destruction that they did not have your best interest at heart. So you move forward and prepare this new life for you, but you move forward humbly. And God has been blessing you because you listen to your intuition, because you're observant, because you seek out the truth. And you were not afraid to conquer your fear. You were not afraid to go it alone. And you did here, Pisces. You sought this knowledge by yourself. And you've been humble. And God has blessed you for this path that you took here, Pisces. You may even be an alchemist. I can't make it up. Bottom of the deck. You know how the transformation of base. It says 
Transformation of base motives and goals into golden wisdom. <laughs> you know how to manifest out here. And I feel like you changed your whole life. Yeah, you're a seeker. Thirst for wisdom and truth wherever they are. You had a, a knowledge for the truth and you went looking. You were not afraid. You did not let your fear stop you here, Pisces. And because you went seeking the truth, the divine, you have been blessed. You release the things that did not serve you. This could be childhood issues. This could be abandonment issues, insecurities, things that were holding you back, mommy, daddy issues, just whatever, control issues. It's different for everybody. And you humbled yourself. And you continue to learn and follow the divine. And you paid attention. You listened to your intuition. You listened to your third eye. You listen to your crown chakra when you get the downloads for your dreams, however you get them. The, the, I keep hearing um, synchronistic numbers, astrology, however you, music, thank you. TV, you get, you get hits, license plates, addresses, thank you on buildings. I heard something about billboards, you see shit on billboards. There's messages, you get them all. Because you're in tune. And you were not afraid to stand on your own. You were not afraid to go it alone. Because you knew you were not alone. You may not you may not have people here in the 3D, but you knew you had your spirit team. You know you had the spirit guides. You knew God had your back no matter what. So you knew you were never really truly alone. So you were not afraid. You conquered your fear. Yeah, look, you could have had magical abilities since you were a child. It says light attribute, seeking the potential for sacred beauty in all things. The belief that everything is possible. And that's the energy you're in, Pisces. You believe that everything is possible. And that's why you're able to manifest anything and everything into your life. Whatever you touch turns to gold. And these people do not like that. They don't like the fact that you left them behind. Because they were still stuck and trapped in fear, afraid to take the sleep of faith. These people don't like the fact that God is blessing you because you took this leap. You, you could be spiritual here, guys, right? And these could be religious people that could have came up against you in the past, saying whatever you was doing was of the devil. It was negative. It was this. It was that. But now they've been watching you, and they're like, well, how could it be of the devil when God keep blessing her? Or God keep blessing him? So now they're, trying, they're starting to see that you are truly connected to the divine. And the more they see that you're truly connected to the divine, the more they hate. Because they were afraid to take this leap of faith with you. Yeah, these people judged you. They judged you. They could have talked about you, talked about what you did. This could be a father, your father, a masculine energy. Yeah, now they feel like a fool because they tried to sabotage you. And you the fucking hero. You're the hero, Pisces. Pisces, all oh, Pisces. Find the Midas, Miser, Pisces energy on placements. Yeah, somebody wanted you to stay stuck. They wanted you to stay trapped. They didn't want you to move out of whatever um, situation you were in. And I feel like this is this was low vibrational energy. They wanted you to stay stuck and trapped in low vibrational energy. And you didn't. You stepped out. You took the blindfolds off. You took the, 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 the self-imposed bandages that kept you stuck. And you walked through the gap in between the sores. You realized you was not stuck. When these people around you didn't want to take this leap of faith. Clarify Destroyer. The King of Cups. 
It's you, Pisces. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. This could also be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio that tried to come up against you. Could be a masculine energy, a masculine Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, which can still be a woman, just in her masculine energy, guys, okay? That tried to keep you stuck. This could also be, don't have to be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Um, this could be someone who had love for you, someone you had love for that wanted to keep you stuck and trapped. Clarify the Atlante. The Ace of Cups. Like I said, this is somebody you had love for. This is possibly somebody you wanted love from with the lovers. They want, you wanted this. But they didn't want to take the leap of faith. I really feel like this is somebody you gave love to in the past. Family, friend, baby's mother, baby's father. That wanted to keep you stuck and trapped. But you learned to love yourself. You took that love and you started pouring it into yourself. You started healing yourself. You came out of the trap. Clarify student. Started learning. Started looking. What did, what did it say? Um, knock and the door. Uh, well, first, first it says seek and you shall find. Knock and the door shall be open unto you. And you started seeking. And when you started seeking, you started finding. So you started knocking and God opened the door for you. Yeah, they tried to block this. Somebody did not want you to move forward. Somebody did not want you to learn to love yourself, to pour this love into yourself. They wanted you to remain stuck and in a lower vibrational energy here. Clarify divine child. Could be a king of pentacles. But I feel like this is you, Pisces. They didn't want you to get this King of Pentacles energy. Could be a father, a husband, a baby's father. Two masculine energies, though, here. The King of Cups and the King of Pentacles. For sure, could be who was trying to keep you stuck. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, or Capricorn energy. But you out here in this King of, King of Pentacles energy. You're blessed. Even if you ain't got a whole lot of money, you're blessed with abundance. Whatever you touch turns to gold. Because you're connected to the divine. Because you're still in this innocent, pure, redemption energy. And because you have a special connection with the divine. You cannot be stuck or trapped. Clarify this detective. Yeah. <laughs> tell you, they, they watch your work. They watch how you make your money. They watch how God keep blessing you. It could be two masculine energies. A king of cups and a king of pentacles watching you. They want to keep you trapped and stuck. But they watch it. Whatever this entrepreneurial thing is that you're doing, they're watching you come up. And they're watching you love what you do. Can I find the lovers, Pisces energy? Yeah. This person is mad because you blocked them. You blocked their love. You blocked their time. You blocked their energy. You're not letting them into your circle because you know with them comes destruction. And you're not going to allow anybody to come in and destroy your peace. Destroy what you built, what you put your time and energy into here. You cut that ass off. Yeah, you rejected their offer. No longer interested in being a friend, being a family member, no longer being a lover or a, a boyfriend or a girlfriend. No longer interested in exchanging energy with this person or these people. And they wanted to stop and block you. Yeah, now they want to come in and apologize. Because they're watching you move forward and love yourself. Like I said, they see, I'm telling you, they judged you in the past. Whatever it was you was doing to make this money, they talked about you. They judged you because you blocked them, because you pulled away. But now they see that whatever it is that you do is real. It's paying off for you. You're in this King of Pentacles energy because of whatever this creative endeavor is that you're doing. And people love what you do. People love what you're giving. Whatever your product is, whatever it is you're selling, whatever this entrepreneurial thing is that you're doing, 
people love it. And these people that you blocked, that you cut off, that you pulled your energy back because you knew they were still low vibrational. They were not doing the work. They were not trying to heal. They were still stuck in the same spot they were stuck in 5, 10, 15, 20 years ago. Still doing the same shit. These people are upset with you. And they try to destroy you. They try to slow up your money, your process. Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, because you walked away from them. I told you. Because you're not giving to them. Because they can't come up off of you. Your time, your energy, your finances. Your knowledge. Yeah, I'm telling you. Power moment. When you shut these people out and you pull back, they didn't think you would ever do that. You shut some shit down. It was a sudden change. And these people decided they want to try to cause you some type of tower. Because when you told them no, when you pulled back, when you was not no longer giving to them Pisces, I just feel like they felt like you would... <laughs> Thank you, Spirit. They took your kindness for weakness. Okay? They took the fact that you had been nice to them all. Maybe they did other shit. You took them back. You befriended them again. Whatever the case may be. They thought that they was coming along with you for this ride. And, and you kicked everybody off the car and you took the ride by yourself. You kicked everybody off the house and you took the ride by yourself. And they upset. Yeah, and you walk right into this will of fortune. Or you're walking into this will of fortune. Luck is on your side. And these people that try to block you, they will receive karma for this. Don't worry. Okay, everything done in the dark will come to the light. How many minutes are we in? 20. I'm only going to pull a couple of these. Pisces. Anthony Pisces needs to know. Huh. Family member. Told you. Family member drama. Sibling rivalry. So it could be your brother, your sister, say mama, father, say bestie, co-worker, cousin, family, friend, grandparents. Didn't I just say all of the above? All of the fucking above. That's who that's who these people are. They're upset. Yeah, seriously, that's an accurate motherfucking report. Check. Check, check. <laughs> just told you the motherfucking truth, y'all. Best better better believe it. They talk shit about you taking this entrepreneurial endeavor. Possibly said it was never going to work. They didn't want you to, they didn't want it to work. They wanted you to stay stuck in lack. <laughs> and you turned out to be the king of fucking pentacles here, Pisces. God blessed you. God keep giving you these gifts. And he finna give you more. And they mad because they, they were unable to block you and you blocked them. Now they gonna come back and want to apologize. Because everything you said, everything you do is accurate. You 100. And they mad because you're not fucking with them. You're not giving to them. <laughs> it's your family, your friends, your cousin, your bestie, your co-worker. It's all here. Grandparents, mama, daddy. All of the above, okay? So if you resonate spicy, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, my fishy babies.